swearing in today makes former Marshall County District Attorney Steve Marshall Alabama's 48th Attorney General. CBS 42 News reporter James McConaughey is in Montgomery with a look at how a new AG could impact the future of gambling in the state. And the newly sworn in Alabama Attorney General spoke and fielded questions about many topics today, including the issue of gambling in Alabama. Now, the state has had a history of conflicting viewpoints on the issue, and Governor Robert Bentley said vast time and resources have been spent debating current laws and developing new laws related to gaming and games of chance in Alabama. That's one of the reasons he gave for the formation of an advisory committee on gaming. When asked about his perspective on the topic as the new chief law enforcement officer, of the state. Marshall said he plans this week to discuss with his staff in the attorney general's office what exactly they can do. Ultimately, the attorney general is responsible for enforcing the law, not necessarily making the policy. One of the things that I would do is make sure that we had consultation with the prosecutors that are on the ground, the law enforcement that's there about whether or not they've made an assessment of what may be going on in those communities is otherwise illegal. But ultimately, it's an independent assessment for us. And if, in fact, we're authorized to act, then I think that we have to act. And Marshall referred to the December ruling by the Alabama Supreme Court that said the state can keep more than 800 electronic bingo machines seized from Green Track. He said the Supreme Court has been clear about what is and is not bingo, and his duty is to enforce the law whether he agrees with it or not. And Marshall also responded to questions about the impeachment probe into Governor Bentley. I'll have more on that at 6. In Montgomery, James McConaughey, CBS 42 News.